Pulse oximetry is often referred to as the fifth vital sign and can provide valuable information about a patient's ability to oxygenate. Existing sensor technology has not kept up with the demands of critical care environments, whether it's from SpO2 lag, weak or unreliable signals during low perfusion, or overcoming motion artifact. The Exhale Assurance Nasal ALAR sensor meets and exceeds all of these demands while providing you cost savings and the potential for better care for your patients. The ALAR sensor monitors at the ALA, the part of the nostril that meets the cheek. This location is ideal because it's where the internal and external carotid arteries meet, making it the highest profuse site that can be accessed non-invasively. Due to its highly profuse location, the ALAR sensor signal is less affected by critical states such as shock and by medications, for example, vasopressors. This means more consistent and accurate readings in critical situations with a reliable sensor that is also designed for continuous use up to seven days. Application of the ALAR sensor is easy and straightforward. Like all SpO2 sensors, correct application is key for the most accurate results. Application begins with good site prep to ensure a clean connection and a strong signal. Wiping the outside of the ALA, and if necessary, swabbing the inside of the nose to ensure clean contact is important for optimal performance. Once the site is prepped, use the provided applicator to apply the sensor to the ALA on the back part of the nostril toward the cheek. Note that the sensor has been designed specifically to fit on the ALA with the larger rectangular curved pad and cable on the outside. Once in place, remove the applicator and position the sensor fully onto the ALA. The durable clip and medical grade silicon pads are designed to be reapplied multiple times. The ALAR sensor does not use adhesives and the LEDs emit very little heat. This, combined with protocols for consistent site check and rotation, can support a skin-safe protocol. Following initial application, the ALAR sensor should be repositioned to the alternate ALA at least every eight hours, checking the skin at the application site at four hours. The sensor can also support a more vigilant protocol to further protect high-risk patients' skin integrity. For patients deemed high-risk, including patients on vasopressors, external cardiac assist devices, and previous or high potential for skin breakdown, alternate ALA every four hours and check the site at two hours. These recommendations should be understood as the minimum check rotate guidelines and can be modified to further support your workflow and or specific patient population. When checking the site or reapplying, Simply place your thumb under the sensor and finger on the outside pad, gently sliding the sensor off the ALA. To ensure patient comfort and mitigate motion artifacts, it is important to secure the sensor once applied. We recommend running the cable under and around the ear. Should the ear be unavailable, you can secure the sensor over the cheek using skin-safe tape. The goal is to make sure the cable does not hang freely from the nostril. If the sensor is being used under a mask, such as CPAP or bi-level NIV, make sure to allow slack in the flat cable under the mask so the sensor is not dislodged. Once connected, give the sensor a few seconds to communicate with your existing equipment and provide a strong signal. The ALAR sensor provides consistent and accurate readings, reducing the need for added ABGs. Due to its durable design, the ALAR sensor can be relied upon for continuous monitoring up to seven days. Over the course of the single patient stay, the sensor can be wiped down with alcohol pads or a damp cloth and reapplied as needed. Other single patient use sensors use adhesives and may need to be changed daily. The ALAR sensor is designed for continuous use and can provide significant cost savings over the course of the average hospital stay. From the OR to PACU, to critical care, to the floor. One patient, one sensor, one cost. The ALAR sensor provides monitoring at the optimal location with the highest rates of perfusion. It is therefore less affected by the issues that plague other sensors. The ALAR sensor is a great one-and-done solution for optimal pulse oximetry monitoring.